Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I have a blast in the past for you guys. This is the video where I get to go back through my whole entire collection and show what I already own love. There are already so many new releases coming out all the time. Um, you know, ColourPop puts new releases out like what, every couple weeks. <laughs> So there's always new eyeshadow palettes and lipsticks and blushes and foundations and just all this new stuff thrown at you and you kind of forget about the stuff that you already own and that you love and that you purchased for a reason. So that is why I decided to start this series. I have gone through uh, and brought back eyeshadow palettes that I had completely forgotten about but I still loved. So that is why I like this series. Um, I do have a playlist so if this is something that you like to watch make sure you guys check out that playlist. There's other creators on there and if you guys actually make this kind of video just let me know and I would love to add you guys to the playlist as well. So this week I decided to concentrate on the Alamar Cosmetics eyeshadow palette. I think this palette is so gorgeous. This was gifted to me by one of my subscribers and I'm so thankful because oh, it's just beautiful. Um, and along with the Alamar Cosmetics blush trio, I think the shade in here, oh, it is so beautiful and it tied this look together perfectly. Like this is my summer shade for blush. I love it. So uh, this week video is also a little bit something different um, that I haven't really done on my channel. I have only ever done one, one <laughs> full cut crease before. I have never attempted it after that. It turned out eh, okay, <laughs> but for being my first time, but I decided, you know what, it is time to do it again. I know I do a lot of half cut creases. Every once in a while I do halo eyes. I really wanted to get down a full cut crease. So that is what I'm bringing to you today. Uh, this is my second attempt at a full cut crease and the Alamar Cosmetics palette actually made it quite easy because it was so easy to blend. And I really think I did a good job. I do have to do my eye looks a little bit differently. Um, I know people who have normal I guess you could say hooded eyes uh, have a smaller lid than I do. I definitely have more lid space than a normal hooded eye person. However, I have deep set eyes. So what this means is when I open my eyes, um, not only do I have this flap over my lid, but I kind of have a piece of my lid that is closed in to the skin. So it makes it difficult uh, to do things like this because some of the eyeshadow is going to completely disappear. Um, you can see as I open my lid and as I shut my lid, uh, a lot of it is gone. So I do have to bring up my lid shade above my normal crease, uh, which at first, you know, it can be a little bit scary because you think that, oh my gosh, this is going to look crazy. But in the end, it doesn't because when you open your eyes, you do have the full illusion of a full cut crease and it works out just fine. So with that being said, if you guys want to see how I created this eye look, then just keep watching. So starting off this look, I'm gonna go in with my Urban Decay Anti-Aging Primer Potion. Using a fluffy brush, I'm gonna go in with the shade Coco Taxi and put this high above my crease. Going in with the new fluffy brush, I'm going to take the shade Tropico and put this in the same exact spot as we did the Coco Taxi. Now going in with a smaller blending brush, I'm going to take the shade Capacito and I'm going to put this in my crease. I'm not going to bring it as high, but I am going to shape this to my eye.
Now going in with my tart shape tape, I absolutely love this for cut creases. I am going to start and put this all over my lid and I'm going to bring this up above my natural crease. Now I did leave this portion in real time because I wanted you guys to see how I created this cut crease. You will also see that I probably should have brought the brown up just a little bit higher, but hey, it's only my second cut crease. I'll do better next time.
Alright guys, so that is it for this blast in the past. With this only being my second full cut crease, I think I did a lot better this time than I did the other time. Um, so yeah, if you guys did like this video, please give it a big ol' thumbs up for me, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!